There are just a few miles of water separating the Isle of Wight from the mainland. But this tiny community is about to play an outsized role in the fight against coronavirus. NHS workers will be the first to download this new app, followed by others on the island later in the week. It will help digitally trace the spread of the disease. The mainland is just over there, and that is the attraction for scientists in choosing the Isle of Wight for the pilot scheme. The population here is relatively small, and it's contained. It's a controllable environment. Now, when the app is downloaded by as many people as possible, it's expected that the algorithms will need tweaking. But if it is successful here, the technology could be rolled out across the rest of the country by the end of this month. Residents have mixed feelings about the new technology. Just the older people don't know how to use it, so it's pointless, really, because they're the most vulnerable people in society on the island. If it helps, then surely, yeah, let's all get out of it and, you know, go back to normal. The app, of course, is not a silver bullet to defeat coronavirus, but the government says digitally tracing could be pivotal to getting the country out of lockdown and safely back to work.